Jesus. Sorry. Okay, we're here. We're going into the room at the. We're at Canada. We're going into the room for the first time. What do you guess? What's up? She's first time. Whoa! Gusty. Our Shh, stuff is on. Shut up, dude. Our, I'll edit it out. We, I, we've we never been edit here. It out. I'll, I'll edit what are you, out. fucking Marvel Studios? We've never been, sh we've we've never been here before. Oh, <laughs> fuck. What do you think of the room, Eddie? I think it's great, but I don't know why. We, you said, hey, Eddie, come outside. I want to just go Shh, talk to people. It. And then... You I didn't first get the footage when we came in first. My camera's packed up. Yeah, but you could have at least given me a warning. We could have tried to fake it a little bit, tried yeah. to deceive everyone. I, did, I want to get the layout of the room. What if someone was here waiting? The layout of the layout of the room includes all of our stuff. Oh, I, yeah. This isn't all complimentary. Oh, sh do we have to pay for this? I don't have my glasses. Gus, our video is screening in like an hour. You got to get up, dude. What? They're what? having a screening in like an hour. We got to oh, go. Fuck, are you serious? Oh, shit. Oh, it's raining outside, Eddie. Gus? What? What? Are you wearing <coughs> Minecraft <coughs> diamond pants? Yep. I don't think it's that much of a joke because you didn't like pull them out and go like, "Hey, Eddie, here's this funny pa pajamas I got." You, you just genuinely wore those to bed and didn't tell anyone. Well, I mean, typically I tend to, I like to stray away from like body shaming and that sort of self-image harm stuff. I don't know what this has to do with body shaming. <coughs> I didn't say anything about bodies. They're we're talking about the pants that you purchased. They were they were on sale and I th they fit my interest. So I don't see the problem with it. What do you mean they fit your interest? You're just going to harass me this whole trip. I don't want to talk about it anymore. Do we have any beers left? You're holding one. Yeah, it's warm and empty. There's a little bit left and it's mine from yesterday. So if you want to just have that I'm on I'm just going to go combine all the mostly empties. Okay. <laughs> I don't need any. Just me and the lamp. <coughs> I got a veggie straw stuck in my throat. Look at that stupid cars in Canada. <laughs> what? What is that? What? <laughs> just, what is this stupid? Oh shit, that's actually Tim Allen from uh, The Big Shaggy Dog. That's uh, the dog that they use too. That's actually where they filmed the American TV show The Office. And right up there is where they filmed the British TV show The Office. Look at all this gridlock. <laughs> Thanks Tr Trudeau, Trudea. Thank you, Justin Trudea. We're gonna go outside. What do you want me to say? We're God damn it. it. We're the city. We're going to... What? We're gonna what? Hi hype up the city. We're gonna hype up the city? No, no, no. Hype up for the viewers. I, can we please leave, leave this Eddie. situation as soon as possible? Eddie, let's You got a camera excited. shoved in my face in the middle. Obama's here, dude. Obama. They say it's the city that never don't sleeps, that but guy. that's baloney because I slept till 1 a.m. They don't say that about the city. They say that it's the city that sleeps, but that's... Should we have this exposure for the whole video? Yeah, that's it. Hey guys, we're here in Toronto. That's where they make the Barty dolls that they sell to young kids. Holy shit, dude, Eddie. Dude, that's, that's Saddam Hussein. Dude. His neck looks better. Did, is that how he died? Yeah, they hung him. Did they? I'm almost positive. I thought that was just a statue that came down. His no, what? What? And they said, Mr. Gorbachev, tear down this wall. Toronto smells really good. But then every 30 feet, it smells like shit for about four seconds. But then it smells really good until the next 30 feet interval. That's up to every city code. Chicago, New York. You can't walk. It's unsafe to walk for 30 seconds without trash invading your nose. Kind of like how Saddam Hussein invaded. <laughs> oh, dude, that's the train from Mr. Rogers' neighborhood when it goes through. At the Polar Express! No, dude, it's the Mo Mr. Rogers train. Can't you see it? Oh, yeah. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. A beautiful day in the for a neighbor. Dude, you're very loud. Could you be mine? Dude, Tom Hanks was Santa and also the conductor, man. When he yeah. staples in Believe. Yeah, your voice crack sounds like Rick and Morty. Maybe I just did that on my own, and not everything is Rick and Morty. I'll do, I'll do Morty. Hey, hey, I don't know, Rick. Dude, that's Kramer from Seinfeld. Some pretty cool future stuff we Stop. got going okay, on we here. Get it. One point thirty-one gigawatts, rich. <laughs> rich. Dude, my dad told me that that whole building is made out of PVC pipe. Really? Yeah. I'd like your dad to tell us more. <laughs> Freeze frame it. I can't. Freeze frame. I can't freeze frame. Do it in post. I, I haven't made it that far in the Adobe do tutorial. It post. Stop, Eddie. Fucking do it, dude. I haven't made it that far in the tutorial. Well, you could back up a little bit, maybe. Right. Stop getting so close, guys. I'm you here. gotta do a wider shot. All right, so we're gonna go get a drink. We're gonna yeah. eat Casey and then theater. Right. So if the people don't know, Casey's doing a speech at Buffer Fest here. You're getting, you're getting closer, it's man. You gotta back up. So. Um, Casey Neistat is uh, doing a speech here at 
at six. So we're gonna finish filming this, we're gonna grab some drinks at the bar, and then what Gut said, we're gonna go eat out Casey at six. No, we're eating and then Casey. Right, we're eating out Casey at six before he goes and speaks to everyone. I don't think he'd allow us to do that. He seems like he's got a tight schedule. Not the only thing that's tight, you know what I'm saying? We, you know what I'm saying? We, give it up, give it up, give it up. <laughs> I didn't catch my go. Ah! Also, less important guys, Obama's here and Hillary Clinton and Bill Clinton and Joe, uh, here. and Joe Biden are here, but also Casey Neistat's here. So, I mean, you can decide who's more important here. It's Obama, but you can decide. I don't know. I didn't vote for him in 2016. Dude, if, o if Obama was up for election in 2016, though, that'd be illegal. That's against the Constitution and what we... That's, I mean, there's amendments for it. Then Casey would win by default then. Dude, that's... You know who my favorite rapper is? What? Two terms! That dude, he's fucking great. That's a bad joke. Don't put that in. Don't put that in. Eddie, I can't... I don't know how to edit everything we shoot has to go in. That's... I don't, I don't believe that at all. I th I'm only recording when we know there's good material. See, I'm recording right now. You got Even what we filmed... Yes. Earlier? Yes. I don't know how to cut stuff. I haven't made it that far in the tutorial. I'm still going. Oh, test, test, this. test. What are we, we gotta go see Casey. I, can we ask, is he gonna do a Q&A? Uh, I'm not sure if he's doing a Q&A, but... If you ask him questions, you gotta, you can't move your face. You gotta talk to him like this. You gotta go, Casey! Casey! And you gotta say his name at the beginning of every question. <laughs> yeah. Casey! What do you mean with camera? Casey, do you like carrots? Do you ever eat carrots? Did anybody call you Carrot Nice Dad? Well, they should. <laughs> Casey. Shit, dude, you gotta stop making the scene. I'm not even kidding. Dude, is that Casey? Are they leaving one chair for him? It starts with one. One chair. I don't know why. When we were on stage, there were more of the five. More like Casey Nice Stand. Because <laughs> he'll be standing. Are you okay? Boy, the buffer helpers have been so... You're so close to me every time. The this buffer is too close for me. I'm, I'm telling them a story. Man, the buffer helpers have been so kind. I hope they're kind to Casey as well. I hope they're a they're Casey nice, nice staff. Yeah, nice staff. <laughs> Get the fucking camera out of I saw in one of Casey's vlogs that he's been working out a lot lately. And he's got a great form too. So he's got a Casey nice ass. You just have to stop. Guys, put the camera down. What? Lower the camera. This, these jokes are not, like, I wish we could be, like, fun, and this is a fun video where, like, yeah. I'm jokingly telling you off, but, like, these jokes are bad. No. Like, this isn't good content, this is bad. I'm giving it my bet. I gave it a Casey no, Nice No, 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 you don't, I don't think you get it. It's bad. It's shit. I thought you were a Casey Nice friend. But That's actually, not even good. <laughs> actually, you're a Casey Nice bad friend. <laughs> Fuck you. Sure was a, that sure was a Casey nice talk. So now we're gonna go back and eat Domino's pizza. Domino's, um, if you tr translate it to Canadian, um, uh, translates to Domingo, which means corn in Spanish. There are far too many people with cat ears here. Home sweet home, Eddie. One more. That's Ava Gordy, I think. I can't remember. I can't remember if that's actually her name, but she's a somebody. To be will eventually be a memory of the time I've tried so hard and got so far, but in the end, hey, I'd like to place an order for delivery. Okay, well, we'll take a small pepperoni pizza and a medium pepperoni pizza, but I don't know the address of the hotel. He, he asked me the room number seven times. Why? I was like, he's like, what is your room number? And I was like, it's 11109. Okay, but the room number? I was like, it's it's 11109. Yes, what is the room number? It's 11-109. Is it racist to do an Indian accent? I don't know if it's, I mean, probably quieter than... I was just wondering if, is it offensive to... That's I think, wait, wait, this is a lesson for, for the actual clip. Yeah. That Gus sat in the way that he did right there, and I didn't think, oh, he's doing it for content. I just <laughs> saw it happen and continued on with my day. Hey guys, uh, still at Bufferfest, you know, still in Canada. Met a lot of great people, uh, especially Dom Farah, he's been wonderful. Hey, what? Hey, can you toss me that uh, Kleenex by the bed, dude? Gus. What? You, you fucking serious? Can Get you back in the bathroom. Out? I gotta finish wiping.
What? Gus, we had two rolls of toilet paper in there. I was in there two minutes ago. What are you fucking talking about? I, you... I went through them. What do you mean you went through them? I used them to, to wipe myself. Gus, that's not possible. The square footage of paper to asshole. They were thin. Yeah, they were paper thin. I went through the wrapping. I can't through. disagree because it is paper. So technically it is okay, paper well, thin. paper or thin. You walked out here like this. I didn't body shame you at all. Body shame? Gus, yeah. you could have just said, opened the door and go, gone, hey, Eddie, grab me a Kleenex, but you decided to Stop, walk out Eddie. like this. Stop. Dude, Jesus, man, what is wrong with you? Just give me a Kleenex. Dude, go, there's got to be more in there. There's, there's no way. There's more in there. I've used them all. I don't believe you. Not Why are you crying, you. Gus? Not crying, Eddie. Stop. Are you kidding me, dude? Hey. It's wiping your ass, man. There's got to be more toilet Jesus. paper. Stop cursing and stuff. We're There's got to be... Stop time. cursing. Yeah. Stop cursing, Gus. Fuck off, man. <laughs> Fuck, dude. You got to be able to wipe more. Are you crazy? <laughs> Are you fucking insane, dude? Let me use your, one of your pillowcases. You oh, got, like, my God, no. Horrible. Dude, you know how many a Latino woman would have to wash her shit out of a fucking pillowcase? Stop being racist. That's man. not racist. That's, That's just racist. a fact. I saw her. She was tired. She wasn't even... Okay, I'm so sorry, a Thai <laughs> woman. And I want to go to bed on a pillowcase that doesn't have your shit on it, Gus. <laughs> I'm sorry. Dude. Please. I'm just trying to and be, you're, represent creators well. And we're not very big. We don't have a lot of subscribers. Yeah, but they've welcomed us very in. But that's because you're not... You're not... When we go to these parties, you're not walking out with no fucking pants on. How much toilet paper was in there before we got here? Fucking 20 rolls? <laughs> no, there's only three. Room service hasn't been here once. It's a mess. Yeah, because they keep coming. Oh, no. Guys, so wipe yourself up. Dude, that's so... Oh, wipe that off your chin. Can you check to see if it... <laughs> oh, my God. Get the fuck... Gus. You, did you even wipe your ass? You were in there for like 20 seconds. You made this a thing. I didn't make it a thing. You just gave me the Kleenex and it wouldn't have been a problem. What? Kleenex, Gus. You're very set on this. I don't... Don't kill yourself. I might. Don't kill I yourself. Might. That'll ruin the trip, Eddie, dude. Come, come on. Let, help me open the window. Okay. I don't even think you could if you wanted to. I'll do it, Eddie. Oh, really? I'll do it. Do it. I said it would. Don't look. Do it. Don't film it, okay? I don't want to get in trouble for jumping. All right. I can still see you. Eddie, can you come close the other blind? I can't reach it. Jesus Christ, man. Oh, my God. Gus killed himself. What will I ever do? Oh, I can tell you're patronizing me. Don't do it. I didn't do it. Oh, shit. Re really? Yeah. Go wipe your ass, man. I can't. <laughs> Do you think I could use these veggie straws as kind of like a <clears throat> makeshift bidet? I don't know if you know uh. what a bidet is. <laughs> I don't know if you know what a bidet is, but it's not what you're thinking of. Uh. I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> I don't know if you know what a bidet is. <laughs> Too close with this the angle. Is, it zooms in when so, you do it. I know, you can move your arm out. Alright, go ahead, dude. So, we're on the red carpet and nobody knows who we are because we're us. You're so close. I don't. So close to the camera, always. Guys, we're on the red carpet. Eddie and I are here at this, um... Wow, that's a close shot. Very fancy gala, gala. We missed the, the tuxedo fitting because we were on stage for the comedy screening. So we're here in regular clothes and nobody else is except for maybe two people. Oh my god. We're very alone. This is the only clothing we have amongst suits and all this stuff, but we did our best. We're still here and we still get free drinks. You're like a, you're like a Midwestern mom right now. <laughs> Smile! Smile. <laughs> get those cheeks up. You look like your father in that sweatshirt. Why would you say that? You know I hate my dad. Okay, we're just doing some press. I think they think we're SoFlo and Logan Paul. Oh, I'm not... I don't have SoFlo no. You're SoFlo, so you're SoFlo. How did you think of, what did you think of Bucket for Fest? I thought it was incredible. I thought everyone we met was really great and I don't have a bit because I'm just in this natural state of bliss. A natural state of Adrian Bliss. Adrian, you were a lovely guy, and if you ever saw this, I'm virtually shaking your hand. Stop, great... dude. I don't have 3D enabled on my channel. What did you think of the uh, Buffer Fest? I just told you what I thought. Everyone was great. Please stop. Oh, my God. Everyone was great. I'd like to do a bit, but everyone was fantastic. I'd like to bitch about people. I'd like to do comedy, but I can't. I'm just happy with everyone. What do you want from me, Gus? This better not be how you end the fucking video.